Good morning! It's Glenda with Fraylins and Friends Crafts Plus. And tonight, we start skinning the cat. I'm going to try doing it from this angle. I've set the camera on the, on my adjacent table here. That's perpendicular. So I am going to try working with this guy that way. See if we can give you a better view. Uh, let's see. I'm going to start here with the head, at least for now. I'm going to try and make my fingers work a little more delicately, which is hard for me with my shakiness because I tend to try to over compensate for the shakiness. Let's see how that's showing up. Oh, not too bad. I hope the lighting is good. I already had thinned out these pieces of clay. You know what what I really the, the thing that gets that is really attractive to me about working with the clay is for one thing it keeps my hands busy it keeps my mind on concentrating on one thing and I just <laughs> I find it very intriguing and relaxing and especially now when we're still all, many of us are still observing all of the precautions and trying to stay indoors and out of trouble, it just is really, really satisfying. I don't feel so confined. <laughs> and you help that too. How's that doing? I mean, there's no way I can keep my hands from working on it. That has to happen. <laughs> oh.
press it into that without making it too thick and heavy. I hear a husband. I hear his steps. Hello, dear. There, we got that. Got the hello. Now he knows where's. He probably figured out where I was at anyway. And now he knows. You wouldn't think it'd be so hard. Just a lot of curves. I don't have to make him look ultra smooth, even though that's kind of the look of the Halloween cat, the silhouette cat. There's a lot of Halloween looking cats. They've got some that they make with witchy hats and all kinds of stuff, but the silhouette cat is the one I'm trying to. Trying to form. Well, what do you think so far? Meow, meow. <laughs> I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and bake this. I might mark this for the legs. I may have to add some wire onto one of them at least. Or I'll just wait and do that after I do get them covered. So I'm going to go ahead and bake this so we'll be back later after he's baked. And we'll do the legs. Well, we'll do the legs then. I think it'll be easier to keep all this clay in place. So I'm going to need to straighten these wires some, but I want them positioned for the board. Okay. Huh. I'm going to soften him and bake him. I hope you enjoyed that. Well, f I wanted to get the whole thing done tonight, but it's not happening. <laughs> so there will have to be a part three for the painting. And then the setting into the wood. So we'll see you tomorrow. Maybe. <laughs> I just want to get the thing done. I think it's going to be cool. It's a matter of getting it done. Thank you. Please subscribe. Click the notification bell and give us a thumbs up because we love you and we want to keep doing this. I do it because I love it and I love you. And I hope you find some, some joy and peace in watching me work. And enjoying the product so smile and wave smile and wave at somebody no matter what's going on outside your door or in this world you have one who cares more and he's taking care of matters he will overcome the world good night